Hello guys, Terra Arts Movie here with another super duper exciting tutorial and today I'm gonna be showing you how to achieve some movie look or film look or cinematic look or whatever you wanna call it with your DSLR footage. Now, um, I know that to achieve some movie look there's a bunch of things that you gotta do. Uh, cinematography is the most important thing but today on this video tutorial I'm just gonna be focusing on how to achieve the mood for your footage um, using some color grading softwares. So basically we're gonna be using two softwares from Red Giant Softwares. I'm just gonna be uh, giving you the link on the description below uh, to buy this um, software. Uh, remember that this is not came with um, Adobe software. This is a third party software that you have to buy it first and install it. All right, so let's just get started. So what is color grading? So for example, I shot this footage right here um, with a flat profile using my Canon 5D Mark II. What is flat profile again? Flat profile is where you're gonna turn down your saturation, your contrast and everything from your camera. So you're gonna have some flat profile. So basically later you can, uh, you know, put it in your editing software on the editing process and you're gonna have, you're gonna color it with the color grading softwares that's it <laughs> and uh, for example this is before this is after Doom! there you go boom and before after as you can see here there's a bunch of color and uh, we have some yellowish lighting and bluish um, a little bit bluish greenish shadow here so basically uh, this video is some parody video so it's it's gonna be funny uh, so I want to make it uh, a lot uh, there is gonna be a lot of saturation going on and then uh, but I also want to make it looks like uh, some action movie so it's like combination of saturation loss of saturation and you know some action movie going on here so uh, so that's it <laughs> that's what I want to teach you guys so basically to create a mood for your movie and you have to understand that so for example uh, if, if I want to make a funny video I can't Put like um, for example here just go to the Lumetri looks and maybe this bleach bypass and I can make it like this this is a perfect maybe for some horror movie with less saturated or whatever but uh, yeah so you got, basically you 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 have to match your color correction and color grading of your video to match the feel of, of or the purpose of the of the movie itself so for example another example here for for a real movie here <laughs> the godfather here we got some yellowish brownish color for the movie because the movie is all about the mafia movie from the 1945 and uh, yeah it looks good it's uh, they want to make it looks old like like for example and yeah it's perfect color grading for this movie or another example is transformer we got some typical blockbuster color grading here with yellowish lighting and um, bluish uh, shadow here like what I did right here um, for my video um, and yeah a typical blockbuster and uh, it's perfect for action movie so for example if you gonna put some color grading like this with yellowish brownish color to this action movie is gonna look weird so basically that's this that's the logic there I hope you understand that so you you can't you know um, color grading can uh, you know sometimes screw up your mood if the mood of your movie if you didn't uh, you know make it right another example is the hobbit here and uh, just lots of saturation going on here because it's an adventure movie and uh, this scene is supposed to be a beautiful shot beautiful scene from the valley here and uh, yellowish uh, lighting again with the bluish shadow area here which is really really nice so I hope you understand that I'm, I'm sorry for my bad English <laughs> and uh, yeah so that is that's that's the basic logic of color grading now um, what I'm going to do here I'm just gonna be showing you how to color correct and color grade your footage so as you can see here this is before this is after wait where is it this is after boom there you go so I'm gonna be use I'm gonna be using Colorista here for color correcting. Boom! There you go. Color correcting is basically brings up your uh, contrast and saturation first, and then uh, color grading with Mojo. Mojo is actually to give you some movie look. So the first thing you're gonna be 
the first thing you gotta understand is before you color grade your footage of course you gotta color correct it color correct it first and I'm just gonna be teaching you how to do both and there you go this is the flat profile and then we're gonna use magic bullet colorista click and drag it to your footage boom that's so easy it's gonna be a very easy tutorial so basically before the color grading remember you have to do the color correcting process you can bring the from the window here window um i forgot <laughs> um reference monitor boom and then you're gonna click here and click yc waveform so basically this is the white area and down here is the black area so if you want to you know make it uh, you if you want to bring back the contrast here make sure these wave thingy here <laughs> not gonna you know uh, go up here so so as you see here is 100 make sure it it is not you know above 100 because it's gonna you're gonna have some blown out footage which is uh, you know over you're gonna have the white area overblown or maybe here the 20 here is the lowest if you push it down below 20 the black area is gonna be too dark so because I I, I, I saw this uh, mistake uh, a lot of mistake like this from the YouTube videos basically a uh, lot of YouTube videos that say oh color grading color correcting uh, test or whatever <laughs> basically they punch the black too much so the mo uh, the video is kind of too dark or maybe the white is too white is gonna uh, you know blown out so that's just a little tips here for the YC waveform now to bring back the contrast from your footage with color colorista 2 you're gonna go down here to the secondary and click the triangle thingy here and go down here to pop i love using pop to uh, bring back the contrast for me i'm just gonna for me by the way i'm just gonna punch it Ooh, if you if you do it to the opposite side it's gonna have some bloomy a uh, uh, bloomy look like here maybe for some wedding clip if you are working for some wedding clip this is good yes okay <laughs> just a little tips right there but for me I'm just gonna make it contrast and more, maybe for me around 55 should be nice and then to bring back the saturation I'm just gonna go up here again and then on the primary uh, down here I believe yeah primary saturation I'm just gonna punch it up to around 40 maybe 50 there you go so basically you already color correct your footage so as you can see here make sure when when you <laughs> when you do the pop here it doesn't you know uh, blown out the white or crush the black too much so we're gonna close close it here and there you go you already color correct your footage really really easy with colorista 2 yay <laughs> so um, by the way you can also make some you know color grading with colorista 2 for example uh, like in transformer movie here you have some yellowish lighting and bluish shadow you can do that here in colorista as you see here shadow mid-tone highlight so it's so easy if you want to make it like yellowish lighting just punch the highlight here to the yellowish to the yellow there you go and then the shadow to the bluish area there you go boom as easy as that or maybe the mid-tone if you want to change also the mid-tone to do some maybe greenish there you go as easy as that and <laughs> but I'm not gonna do that because I'm just gonna use magic bullet mojo for the color grading and then we're gonna use mojo click and drag it to your video boom there you go what I love about mojo is it's really fast because it's just it's almost like a preset but you can you know uh, play with it uh, more <laughs> than just a preset and uh, lots of people hate it lots of people love it well I love it because it's easy and it's fast and uh, yeah so for example here for my video it is this is too too cool uh, too bluish for my video I want to make it uh, a little bit yellow so for the mojo balance here I'm just gonna punch it to the left if you do it too much you are gonna have some this too much yellow well, by the way I use this also for my previous video if you guys already watch it the uh, lucky look you know lucky look video when you have some you know because I want to make it like looks like a cowboy um, uh, you know 
cowboy movie lucky look obviously and uh, if you want to make it like really really hot you can do that with this color green technique just warm it uh, the, the mojo balance basically gonna punch it to the left but I'm just I'm not gonna do that for now there you go and then again uh, you, you, you can see this warm it if you go left it's gonna uh, it's gonna make it cooler if you go right it's gonna make it warm look like that but again I'm not gonna do that boom this is good for me and punch it if punch it is for the saturation if you punch it too much it's gonna have some loss of contrast going on here I'm, I'm sorry not saturation but contrast <laughs> so this is good for war movie if you if you see this for mo war movies actually pretty good lots of war movie uh, has this uh, color grading style but again I'm not gonna do that <laughs> I'm gonna bring back the punch I'm just gonna put it here there you go and bleach bleach is for you know um, the saturation bleach is the saturation if you go down you're gonna have some ooh, too much color going on here we go up you're gonna have some desaturated uh, looking image this is also good for war movie or horror movie you're gonna make it desaturated like so that is for example by the way but again I'm not gonna do that just gonna give it a little saturation actually there you go alright guys so that's it I already have my color grading here <laughs> for some crazy crazy guy here and there you go so for example what is color grading for now so let's see this if I turn it off this is a flat profile I shot it in the golden hour so what is golden hour again golden hour is uh, from 3 um, p.m. to almost sunset so basically you have this sunset going on here and it's gonna looks good for your movie um, if you don't have you know uh, those you know lighting equipments uh, the Sun is a perfect a free tools for your uh, lighting for your uh, for your video so but because I'm using a flat profile you can barely you can't barely see uh, you can barely see the, the the sunset so with color correcting and color grading there you go you, you get the sunset you get the shadow which is I make it bluish and like so I hope you understand it so that's it guys that's all about color correcting and color grading with uh, Mag magic bullet softwares here from red giant softwares magic bullet colorista and magic bullet mojo why i recommend recommend this these softwares because these softwares is so easy to use and um, the result is as you can see here <laughs> really great all right so guys that's it and <laughs> this this video is gonna be uploaded soon uh, it's, it's basically a parody for you know Indonesian superhero basically just uh, you know a show for kids in my country here I'm just making a parody <laughs> so if you want to see a little bit there you go uh, it's a funny parody but of course there's there's gonna be a lot of video facts also I guess the terror artist movie here I hope you find this tutorial useful um, subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching and subscribing and see you in the next cool videos and tutorials ciao